We'll start with you. How'd that feel? Just, you know, kind of kind of get that monkey off your back a little bit. I know, obviously, t time's been tough recently, Just be, but be able to have that first half. It was good. Just um, that zone, it opens up a lot of spots. It's easier when a guy's on face guard you. So uh, we made some good plays, just got the ball moving, and um, they went down tonight finally. So it just felt good to finally see it go through the hoop a few times. Were you working with Bobby Knight on the shot fake? Or? You know, I wouldn't work with him. He's too scary. But, um, <laughs> no, just I got to use that as a weapon because, I mean, as you could tell, they were flying up in the air. So... Just um, I, somehow I got to the rim. It's very rare when I got there a few times. Oh my God, I'm right there. So <laughs> it was um, they just the pump fake work and just the spacing of our offense helped out a lot. Is, it, is that something you anticipated would work for you tonight, or not really? Just instincts. Just if they're flying out, pump fake. See if they go. If they don't, then shoot it. So um, I mean, just we played good tonight. We just got the ball moving. That zone can be tricky, but if you get the guys in the right spots, you can kind of break it down. That's what we did. Anthony, with him and Thomas are, are doing what they're doing. In the First half, there was clearly your two leading scorers and kind of carried you guys. Uh, what does it add to the team when him and Thomas are doing? Yeah, I mean, with Jeff, we don't we we expect him to make those threes, and he's gonna. You know, we don't stress about that at all. Jeff's in a slump, whatever. He's gonna come back. It's Jeff. And Thomas has been huge this year, um, coming off the bench and starting a couple times. He's just bringing a lot of energy and knocking down a lot of key shots. So, I mean, he's shooting nearly 50 percent from the three or whatever it is. So Thomas has been huge for us as well. Anthony, you know, for you guys, you know, you, you kind of had that double digit lead and. We're able to maintain it throughout. I know you know con consistently you weren't able to get you know get it up to 20 or whatever, but consistently that they they would score a basket, but you guys were able to answer. You didn't let them get much of a run to kind of get back into it. How big was that for you guys? Because this year maybe that's you know that, that that's happened before. You guys have been out 12, 14, and teams get within a couple. Definitely, uh, they made a pretty a uh, couple good runs. You know they came at us, but we were able to keep that above 10. And you know uh, a lot of uh, uh, practice during practice this week we were keen in on defense, and you know I think we did a good job tonight. Jeff, can you guys talk a little bit about going to Ryan more in the, in the second half? And was that kind of a concerted effort? I mean, they really don't have anybody that can match up with him. Yeah, I mean, Ryan's just in beast mode right now. Um, I don't know what he's doing or how he's doing it, but he's, I mean, that one possession, like three rebounds, and you can't teach that. He just has it in him right now. And, I mean, he just, he's sealing better. He's doing a good, I mean, that senior leadership, betterness, I mean, he's just pounding guys in there, and he just knows his moves now. He's comfortable. So, I mean, he's just a threat inside. That's something we really haven't had here at Boise State since I've been here. So, it's I've been, I love it. Just Ryan's been a big guy threat. How